What's going on guys? Welcome to episode 9 of our Duke Road to Primetime Dynasty. We, this is our week 6 game. We are playing the Miami Hurricanes at home. Uh, hopefully this game will be a good one. Um, I think it will be. Uh, you just never really know uh, going into this, but uh, we will have a long game. It's about a 21 minute video. So, uh, you know, as we're looking at Bubba Donaldson, he's our uh, free safety, I'm pretty sure. And uh, so he's, he's looking to make a big difference i think actually he's a cornerback sorry uh but uh he's looking to make it no he is a free safety he's looking to make a big difference uh, on the field today and uh miami's getting stretched out and ready to go because this will be a good game and uh so uh, let's get to it so opening play of the game duke Wright is looking to hand the ball off to odom and odom will be stuffed at the line so second and ten and uh, Wright's going to hand the ball off to Odom once more. He's going to go to the right-hand side and get a nice pick of about seven on the play. So third and three. And uh, Wright is looking to uh, audible out of this play. And so uh, he's going to drop back the pass. He's going to look to his left. And he's going to find Anderson. But Anderson drops the ball over the middle of the field. So it's going to be fourth and three. They're going to go for it. And uh, Wright's going to hand the ball off to Odom. And uh, actually... Uh, he's going to get somebody to drop, jump off sides, but uh, actually it ends up being a false start. So that will back up the offense. It will be fourth and eight, so we will have to punt the ball away. Try to drive him off sides. Didn't work. So uh, Miami has the ball now. About the 43-yard uh, line, and uh, Schmidt's going to toss left to Robinson, and Robinson gets plowed, and he fumbles the ball. Adams picks it up, and Adams is going to return this one for a touchdown down the sidelines. And so Duke... Gets six points on the board, but uh, so we get another look at this. Uh, he picks up the ball and a uh, nice return for the touchdown. Um, and uh, looking bright for Duke, but uh, as we can see here, uh, they are actually going to review this one. And uh, so uh, we do not actually get a replay, but uh, the call was overturned. They say his knee was down, so we are actually going to take a look at it ourselves. As we look right here, uh, there he gets hit. It looks like the ball is already coming out in the process of going towards the ground. But uh, I guess they didn't see that. But on the other angle that I will show right here, uh, his knee touches before the ball is completely out. So technically right there, his knee touches, the ball is not out. So second and three now for uh, Miami after that run by Robinson. Uh, the non-fumble. Uh, Schmidt's going to fake the handoff to him. And he's going to look to the right-hand side and find Robinson. And Robinson has a nice first down pickup for Miami. So first and 10 for Miami. And uh, Schmidt is going to hand the ball off to Robinson. Robinson is going to make a man miss. And he's down the left-hand side of the field. And Robinson is gone. Touchdown Miami. So they are up early 7 nothing. Um, so after a negative one yard rush by Odom, Wright's going to hand the ball off to him, and Odom's down the, going up the middle of the field for a nice pick of about seven on the play. So it's going to be third and four, and Wright's going to hand the ball off, fake the handoff actually, and drop back the pass. He's going to look deep downfield, and Pruitt's going to come back to the ball and get this one for the first down. So uh, Duke's making a good drive, and they are down early, so they're making a good drive to possibly come back. So uh, Wright's going to hand the ball off to Odom, and Odom goes up the middle, and he gets a nice pick of about six on the play. So it's going to be second and six. And uh, Wright's going to call an audible off the line of scrimmage. He's going to drop back the pass. He's going to look over the middle, but he's going to be sacked first. So third and eight now for this Duke Blue Devil offense. And uh, Wright's looking to throw deep. And he's going to look to his left deep. And he's going to be picked off by Waller. And Waller has the interception. He's going to return this one. He's going to go to the 40. Wright's going to try to cut him off. He's going to make him push out of bounds about the 35-yard line. So first and 10 now for Miami. Uh, in good field position, and uh, Miami's going to, uh, Smith's actually going to drop back the pass, he's going to scramble to his left-hand side, throw back across the body, and find Albert uh, for the first down, that was kind of wacky, so it's going to be first and goal uh, for Miami, and Schmidt is going to run the option, he's going to toss back to Robinson, Robinson's going to get down about the two-yard line, so it's going to be second and goal now, and uh, Schmidt is going to run an option play again to the left-hand side. And uh, he's going to toss back. And it's going to be a fumble, but it goes out of bounds. So it'll be third and goal uh, about the 19, 18 yard line. So Schmidt's going to drop back to pass. Going to look to his left and he's going to lob it into the end zone. As Albert's going to catch that one for a touchdown. So Miami's up 14 to nothing uh, early in this game. And so uh, Duke is going to dig themselves out of this hole. So uh, 
right is going to drive back the pass. He's going to look to his right and find Jacobs for a good nine yard pickup. So it's going to be third and one running the no huddle offense and uh, going to uh, call an audible four verticals. Right's going to drive back the pass, going to look deep down the field. And he has Jacobs. Jacobs at the 30. He's making men miss. And he's at the 10. That's a touchdown. Duke. They are just strike right back. 7 to 14. What a play. That was the longest touchdown pass in NCAA history. Jason Wright uh, gets it done. So 7 to 14. What a play. Uh, so uh, Miami takes over. It's going to be first and 10 for him. And Schmidt's going to draw back to pass. Going to look deep downfield. And he has his man, Albert. And Albert's down the field. And he's going to be finally tackled at a 10 yard line by Pope. So it's going to be first and 10 right back. That was a really scary. And uh, so it's going to be first and 10. Schmidt going to drive back to pass. He's going to look to his right and find Cox. And Cox gets taken out of bounds about the 6-yard line. Or, sorry, about the 9-yard line or 8-yard line. So it's going to be third and 7 now uh, for uh, Miami offense. And Schmidt's going to drive back to pass. He's going to find Leak. And Leak is stuffed uh, right before the first down marker. So it's going to be fourth and 1 now. And uh, they're going to go for it right at the goal line. And uh, Schmidt is going to drop back to pass. He's going to be taken down, and he's going to throw it away. So it's going to be a turnover on down. So it's going to be second and nine now after a one-yard rush by Odom uh, for Duke. And Wright's going to drop back to pass. He's going to look down to the left inside and find Anderson for the first down. So it's going to be first and ten after a three-yard rush by Odom. It's going to be second and seven. They're going to run it with him again. He's going to scramble to the right-hand side for a nice pickup of about six. It's going to be third and one for this Duke offense. And... Uh, Wright's going to drop back to passing and look deep to his left hand side and find Anderson who drops the ball. So it'll be fourth and one. They're going to go for it. Uh, Wright's going to send a man in motion, Osborne, and he's going to make a man jump off sides. And they're going to get a free play here. And so it'll be first down, anyways, but they will go ahead and take the penalty as we see it's offsides on the Miami defense. And so uh, Steve Leach. So it'll be first and 10 at our own 42 yard line. So uh, again, good break for this Duke offense. So it's going to be first and 10 for Duke. And Wright is going to look to pass. He's going to drop back to pass. He's going to look to his left and find Jacobs on the nice crossing route for a nice pickup of about eight on the play. So it's going to be second and two. Looking to run the draw play. Going to hand it off to Odom. And Odom has a nice chunk of yardage in front of him. So it's going to be first down and ten. So after a two-yard rush, uh, Wright is going to do some play action, hand the ball off to Brigham. And he's going to wait for his man, Osborne, on the fade route. And he's going to get a nice pick of about 10 on the play. So it'll be first and 10. Going to turn in that into a second and nine after a one-yard rush. Wright is going to hand the ball off to Brigham, who's going to be stuck to the line. So third and 11. They have a good drive going on right now. So uh, Wright's going to run no huddle. He's going to call four vertical. And uh, he's going to drive back to pass. He's going to look deep downfield to Kevin Love, uh, Kevin Taylor. sorry. And uh, Waller's going to intercept him again. And so that will be another interception, two interceptions on the day. So that amazing drive comes to a halt. And so now Schmidt in the Miami office will take over. Schmidt's going to drop back to pass. Good look to his right and find Hagen. Who Hagen steps out of bound on his cut. It's going to be second and one now. And uh, Schmidt will go ahead and hand, uh, drop back to pass. He's going to look over the left-hand side and find Alston. And Alston has the first down. So first and ten for this Miami offense. And uh, he's going to send a man in motion, Schmidt is. And Schmidt's going to drop back to pass. Going to look deeper left inside. And he's going to be picked off by Woodward. And Woodward's got nobody in front of him. That's going to be a touchdown. So what a strike uh, by this defense to get that nice defensive touchdown. And uh, we'll get a better look at that uh, play later. And uh, so now Schmidt, first down and 10. He's going to drop back to pass. Going to look deeper left inside and find Hagen, who gets pushed basically to the first down marker and basically gets face masked. So it's going to be first and 10. Schmidt is going to drop back to pass. He's going to go ahead and scramble himself. He's going to scramble for this first down marker. And he's going to pick up the first down and get a nice chunk of yards. So it's going to be first and 10 now for the Miami offense. And Schmidt is going to send his man in motion. He's going to drop back to pass. He's going to look. He's going to wait in the pocket. He's going to look deep down the field towards the end zone. It's going to be picked off by Donaldson. Bubba Donaldson's got his first interception, I believe, of the season. And he's going to rumble to about the 32-yard line. So uh, Duke will take over first and 10. Wright's going to drop back to pass. He's going to get tackled and sacked second and 17. Turns into third and 17 after incomplete pass. So third and 17. He's going to call an audible. It's going to be uh, four vertical, and Wright's going to drop back to pass. He's going to look deep down the field, and he has his man Jacobs, and Jacobs is wide open at the 10. Touchdown, Duke. 
They go up 21 to 14. That is 21 unanswered points after being down 14 to 21. So at the beginning of the second half, uh, Schmidt's going to hand the ball off to Robinson. Robinson will scramble for a nice pickup in the first down, about 15 yard pickup. So it's going to be second and seven now after a three yard rush by Chris Robinson. And Schmidt will go ahead and drop back to pass. And he's going to look to his left side and find Robinson. Robinson has the first down and a lot more, and he's taken out of bounds with a hard hit. So it'll be first and ten. That translates over to third and seven after that amazing catch by him. And so uh, Schmidt's going to drive back to pass. He's going to look deep down the field, and it's going to be picked off by Donaldson again. Bubba Donaldson getting his second interception of the day and of the season, I, I believe. So first and ten now for this Duke. Uh, offense and uh, Wright's going to look over the left hand side and find Odom for a nice seven yard pickup. So he has 231 yards passing on eight for 13. So what a day already! Uh, but he also has two interceptions, I believe. And so uh, Wright's going to hand the ball off to Odom now, and Odom will uh, go to the right hand side and get a nice first down. So after incomplete pass, it's going to be uh, Wright's going to drop back to pass and he'll look deep down left hand side. He has Kevin Taylor. And Kevin Taylor has nobody in front of him. That's going to be a touchdown. They're going to go up 28-14 to 14 in the third quarter. So 28 unanswered points. Uh, and so uh, Schmidt and the Miami offense will take over. It's going to be second and 12 after a negative two-yard rush. Schmidt's going to hand the ball off to Robinson. Robinson's going to go up the middle for a nice pickup of 12 on the play. So it's going to be second and 10 after an incomplete pass. Schmidt is going to drive out the pass. He's going to fake the handoff. He's going to throw it down the field to Elbert and Elbert has the first down, so it's going to be third and eleven now for Miami. And uh, Schmidt is looking to uh, drop back to pass, and he's going to look deep over the middle and find Robinson. And uh, not really deep, but a short, nice crossing route or cutback route. So it's going to be first and ten now for Miami. And Schmidt will drop back to pass. He's going to look to his left and find a wide open Leak, and Leak will be plowed out of the uh, out uh, out of bounds for for a nice seven yard pickup. So second and three. And uh, Schmidt's going to hand the ball off to Robinson. He's going to go up the middle for a nice big chunk of yards. So it's going to be first and 10 for the Miami offense. And uh, Schmidt's going to hand the ball off to Robinson. Again, Robinson scrambles for a nice pickup of about 10. But it's going to be second and inches now. And uh, Schmidt's going to fake the handoff to Robinson. He's going to find his fullback, Cox, for a nice pickup and the first down. So after a incomplete pass, Schmidt... He's going to drive back to pass. He's going to look to his left and find Hagen, but Hagen drops it. So it's going to be third and ten. And uh, this defense is holding up pretty well down here in the red zone. And uh, Schmidt's going to drive back to pass. He's going to look to his right-hand side and find uh, his man, but he will drop it again. So it's going to be fourth and ten. They will go for it. I mean, why not? You're down by 14. And uh, so uh, Schmidt will drive back to pass. He's going to look to the left-hand side. And he's going to Alston and uh for the touchdown, so it's going to be 28-21. Miami is uh, uh, down still by a touchdown, but Duke is up, and so that's good. And so uh, Wright's going to hand the ball off to Odom, and it is the fourth quarter. I forgot to mention that, so uh, it just now transitioned to, to the fourth quarter earlier in that Miami drive. But Wright's going to hand the ball off to Odom. Odom will get a nice pick of about six on the play. So after a three-yard rush, uh, it's going to be third and one. Wright is going to drop back to pass. He's going to look deep to the right-hand side, and it's going to be picked off by Harris. I believe that was the third interception of the game by this Miami defense. So uh, that is a costly uh, turnover. And so uh, Schmidt and the Miami office will take over after one negative one-yard loss. Schmidt will drop back to pass. He will be tackled and hit hard. So uh, third and 11 now. Uh, Schmidt will drop back to pass. And he's going to look to the right-hand side. And he's going to be caught by Elbert. Well, I had no idea how it even happened because Pope was able to uh, he was going to be like right there for an interception, but he backed away. So it's going to be second and 15 after a false start penalty and an incomplete pass. Schmidt will drop back to pass. Going to look to his right. Going to find Hagen again. So seven uh, about six-yard pickup. So it's going to be third and nine. Schmidt will drop back to pass. He's going to hand the ball to Robinson on a draw play. And Robinson will scramble for a nice pickup and the first down. So this defense is having trouble. Duke needs to step it up if they plan to win this game but Schmidt will run the play action Schmidt will look downfield and find Robinson Robinson gets a nice pickup of about 20 yards on the play so first and 10 from the 20 yard line Schmidt will hand the ball to Robinson and Robinson has nobody from him he breaks a tackle and he's going to be finally brought down about the four yard line that was a touchdown saving tackle by our linebacker here uh, so Schmidt will drop back to pass first and goal he's going to scramble he's going to look to his left and find Leak and Leak will be basically pushed down about the one yard line so it's going to be second and goal 
Schmidt will send a man in motion, and he will run a toss to the right, and he's going to give the ball to uh, Williams. Williams, yeah, and he's going to get a touchdown. So it's going to be 28 to 28 with a minute 11 left in the game. And uh, Wright's going to hand the ball off to Odom. And Odom will get a nice pickup about seven on the play. So it's going to be second and three, running the four vertical play. Wright's going to drop back to pass. He's going to look deep down the field. It's going to be picked off again by Jacobs. And uh, Jacobs going to return this one back down to about the 30, 29 yard line. It's going to be first and 10 for Miami. And uh, Schmidt is going to drop back to pass. Is going to look downfield to the left in, uh, in the middle. He's going to find Robinson for the first down. So uh, they will take a timeout. So it's going to be fourth. Uh, so it's going to be uh, first and ten with 46 seconds left in the game. And uh, Schmidt will hand the ball off to Robinson up the middle, uh, and he will get a nice pick of about six on the play. So third and five now after a one yard loss and a Duke timeout. Uh, Schmidt. Is looking to go into the end zone. He's going to hand the ball off to Robinson. And Robinson breaks free for a touchdown. So they go up late 35-28. And so on the ensuing kickoff, uh, Pope is back deep to return this. And Pope will get a nice block right there by Jacobs. And he will return this one down about the 35-yard line. So 30 seconds left at the 35-yard line. Uh, right, and this offense is looking to make an impact. And uh, Wright will drop back to pass. Going to look deep down the field, and it's almost picked off by Waller. Waller was right there, so it's going to be second and ten. And uh, Wright's going to look go deep again. Twenty six seconds left. Clock is t uh, not ticking actually, so Wright's going to drop back to pass. Going to look to the left hand side. Fun. Reyes. Reyes is wide open. He's making men miss as they dive after him. That's going to be a touchdown. They go up. Actually, they tie the game thirty five to thirty five with no seconds left in the, in, in the game. Four seconds left, third and ten by Miami, and uh, Miami is going to drop back to pass. Schmidt is looking deep down the field. Hail Mary pass. It's going to be intercepted by Smith. We are going to overtime. So uh, what a play by this Duke defense. They stepped up at the end of the game right there to get the interception. So we were going to overtime, 35-35. So I chose to go on defense first because uh, I want to do that. And so uh, Schmidt... He's going to hand the ball off to Robinson, and Robinson's going to break a tackle, and he's going to scramble to the, out to about the 10 to 9 yard line. So, uh, second and goal now after a negative 2 yard rush, and uh, Schmidt is going to drop back to pass, and he's going to uh, look, he's going to actually going to keep the ball and scramble, and Schmidt has nobody in front of him. He's going to finally be tackled about the 1 yard line, so it's going to be third and goal for the Miami offense, and uh, Schmidt is going to. Toss right again the Williams and Williams will get in so they go up in overtime 42 to 35 but we get a chance on offense we're going to hand the ball off to Odom and Odom will go up the middle for a nice pickup of about five on the play so it's going to be second and five Wright is looking to run Odom again and Wright's going to hand it off to him and he will be stuffed at but not before he got a two yard uh two yard gain on the play so third and three going to hand the ball off to Odom again and Odom's going to get a nice pickup about and a first down uh, so after a uh, after a zero yard rush by Odom, it's gonna be second and ten. Wright's gonna hand the ball off to him again, and he's gonna be stuffed. So it's gonna be third and eleven now, and running the hurry up offense. It's be third and eleven. Wright's going to drop back to pass. He's going to look to the left inside, find Anderson who catches the ball. It's gonna be fourth and three now, and so uh, now uh, Wright's going to hand the ball off to him again. And uh, he's actually going to call an audible real quick. And uh, Wright's going to drop back the pass. He's going to look over the left-hand side and find Anderson, who catches the ball and almost gets to the end zone. But it's going to be first and goal. So now uh, Brigham is going to look to run the Wildcat with uh, Covington. And Covington will go to the right-hand side and get a touchdown. So we tie up the game. We're going to second overtime now. So we get the ball back after an incomplete pass. Uh, going to hand the ball off to Odom. And uh, Odom will get stuffed, but not before he gets a one-yard gain. And uh, we got the ball back because we, had, we were on offense last. But uh, Wright will uh, get the ball. He's going to throw deep. And he's going to find Pruitt in the end zone. Touchdown. He falls into the end zone. So we go up 49-42. Uh, now it's Miami's turn on offense. And so uh, Miami, uh, Schmidt is going to drive back the pass. He's going to look to left-hand side and find Alston. And Alston will catch that ball. So it's going to be first and goal for Miami. And uh, Schmidt is going to... Hand the ball off. Oh, actually, sorry. He's going to drop back the pass. He's going to run for himself. He's going to shred a tackler. And he has nobody there. And he's going to finally be tackled about the two-yard line. So second and goal for uh, Miami. And he's going to pitch left with Robinson. Robinson will dive in the end zone. So it was a tie game. 49-49. They get the ball first in third overtime. And uh, so third overtime. First play of third overtime. Schmidt is going to drop back the pass. He's going to look deep into the end zone. And it's going to be 
picked off by Rodgers. Rodgers has an interception, and he brings it out to about the five-yard line. Doesn't matter. We get the ball back at 25, at the 25-yard line anyways. So we're going to hand the ball off to Odom. And Odom will go to a nice pick of about, uh, 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 sorry, seven on the play. So after an incomplete pass, it's going to be third. And, actually, sorry, after a negative uh, rush. Be third and six. Going to hand the ball off to Odom, and so now the game-winning field goal. Here we go. Fourth and seven. It's up. Mosley's kick is. It hits the top of the upright, but it goes in. Duke wins this in overtime. As we get another look at this, right there, it hits it, but it is a touchdown. Duke wins 52-49. Third overtime. What a game. What a great statement by Duke to pull through at the end. Three overtime victory. Again, final score, 52-49. Duke beats Miami. What a game. And here is the play of the game. Woodard's interception. He grabs it with one hand behind him. And he makes it back all the way back to the end zone to tie it up. 14-14. That was back like in the second quarter. And so uh, that was a great play. And that was the reason why we won the game really. Uh, other than the Reyes touchdown at the end. And so uh, what a great game. Uh, it was really exciting as a uh, show of sportsmanship right there by both coaches. And uh, so, uh, great game, uh, great win, and uh, the Duke fans are happy. So next time, guys, we will come back and we will play the Louisville Cardinals uh, at Louisville. They are four and one. We are three and one on the season. And so I hope you guys enjoyed that game. It was exciting, uh, long video, I know, but uh, hey, it's better than chopping it up a lot more. Uh, so uh, thank you guys for watching again. What a great game, three overtimes, a great victory, and a lucky field goal at the end, really. So. Uh, uh, again, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next time for the Louisville game and the uh, Week 7 recruiting. Bye.